right, it's Monday, and uh, we got a whole bunch of cabs on the weekend, so we're uh, we're gonna do some sorting and move a whole bunch of pear out to the pasture, and we'll see whether we continue to have more cabs. Trixie's, Trixie's calving. I think Dylan had thought that. Okay, this is Dylan's Trixie. She's calving, water bag broke. Um, <clears throat> the mucus coming out the back end of her was uh, pretty yellow so I don't like that all right we'll go for a walk on this side this side has all pear all cows and calves are on this side see all the calves are doing So far, so good. Here's Minnie. Minnie's all curled up here. Hey, little buddy. We let him outside. Now you're doing good, bud? Hey? He's still small. But he's doing all right. All right, me and Quinn are gonna start moving some calves into the barn. Trixie, settle down, calf already. Hey, let's go, let's get up there, sweetie. Come on, up you go, come on. We're gonna bring her in and check her, see if everything's lined up. We don't like it when the mucus gets, uh, when that fluid gets really dark yellow. Oh, where is she now? There she is, yeah. All right, let's go. So we're gonna check her to make sure that it's not, she's not settling down anyway. Watch, she'll have twins. No, thank you. <clears throat> Don't bother. We've been bringing calves in. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Upside down again. Oh, I got a flipper now. So I'll need chains, I'll need uh, another glove. So when the calf is upside down, she was tight in the back end. Because um, if the calves are upside down, she pushed the water bag out. But the calf's feet aren't coming proper, so then she's not dilating proper. So. Uh, now uh, I gotta flip that calf, and we gotta start pulling it back. <laughs> I think last year we had one, maybe two upside down. This is number three already. 
And so far the other two had to get two sections. Turn already. You might have a turn already. You still want me to phone it in? No, not yet. Okay, sorry. I was just about to dial. We have to keep the power. I just don't want to rip this. I gotta. Okay, which one is it? The left one is. Okay, I'm backing off. I'm gonna try and get it on proper. You want to push? We gotta pull. Keep coming. There we go. Welcome to the world. Come on. She's a little bit. No, no, I She got the fluid out. She got poop on that. Here you going, Drexie. That's a big baby. Holy shnakey. Bull calf. That's big. That is a big one. Do I get a glove? Do you have a glove? Yep. Yeah. One right here. No, oh, you have one? Okay. I can get it. Pull this calf out of the way. Give me that one. You got the. Yeah, he's just gonna check for twins. I doubt it, but. <laughs> yeah, you never know. Just put you on to pull this. Yeah. Pull her or him into the corner. I will get the jack out of there. With that big of a cast, there better not be another one. Holy, that's a big one. Uh, all right, we're good. Hey, we got to get medic oh, to everybody. Trouble, hey? Hey. Let's, uh, let's prop it up properly though here. Yeah. yeah, prop it up and then we'll let her out. Hey, that's a big bull calf. That let, oh, pull it back. There you go. I guess you needed help this time. And while we were working on here, I think Daryl and the boys were all bringing the calves in. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Yeah, there's a whole bunch in here that we need to ship out. So, I'm a bloody mess. Anyway, it's out, it's alive. You liking it? Oh yeah. Well, she takes care of her calves, it's just. Oh, this is kind of nice. There's one going in. 
two going in. Three. Looks like they know where they need to go. Man, it's nice working with cows that aren't wild. Not saying we don't have any, but for the, <clears throat> for the most part, most of our cows are pretty quiet. I got... Yeah, your cow, your calf's in the barn. Let's go there, okay? Come on. Yep, 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 yep. Let's go. You go in the barn. That's where your calf is. Keep going. No, no, no. In the barn. There you go. Yeah, we literally get one in and another cow decides to come back. So they're kind of doing this themselves. Let's go, sweetie. Come on. Let's go. Yep. Let's go. Come on. In the barn. Let's go. Yep. Hit, cow. Hit. Get in there. Close the guy up. There we go. Hit, cow. Hit, cow. Hit. Here's our, uh, the one we had on the weekend. It was a C-section. This calf was upside down as well and head would not follow into the birth canal so you have to get pulled out the side door as well right. Good morning everybody uh <clears throat> we're gonna move some uh cow calf pairs to our farther pasture just to get rid of some animals in here and then I'll, uh, he's going to bring, you get the half ton here, back the, tra back the cattle trailer up to here and he'll bring the calves in the front, I think there's eight of them, and then uh, we'll get those in first in the front. As soon as the calves are in the front, the mo mothers know that where they are, they'll go right in the trailer, it's no problem, we don't have to sh try to shove them and the shove the cows in there, they'll go in there, no problem. They already know, so... Keep putting pressure on him. Come on, yep, up you go. Hey, hey. Velvet, you're being dumb. Come on, up you go, up you go. Come on, keep, keep walking, keep going, or else they're gonna turn around on us. There. Okay, we are out here where there are 16, we have 16 pair out here right now. And as we pulled up, we noticed that there was a hole. The calves in, the calves in the, we're all ripping around. That's what I like to see. We got a lot more room out here. It's drier. That's why we're moving them out here. 
I don't think they should get out. I hope not. You grab the door. There, I'll probably have to go in and grab the calves, I'm guessing. There we go. it up in half here there you go that's a nice that's small heifer another one that's not very big right now i think when every cow calves i'm thinking there's another one but that is not a very i don't think that's very big Okay, just before lunch, we moved in uh, Jolene, one of our cows. She showed that she was calving. Be quiet, be quiet. And I think the feet might be upside down, which means it could be backwards. We're gonna check on her. You know, we'll find out. Upside down, one calved nice and easy, and now we got possibly backwards. If it's not upside down, it's just really big. No, it's just really big. Well, that's better than backwards. We're going to keep letting her work at it then. So sometimes when the feet come, when the feet are coming out, the feet are, they're not coming both straight like this. They'll come like at an angle or sideways and the other one, when the second one comes, that's when you can determine whether they're both backwards or how. And because these feet are both quite large, the first one's coming like this and the second one's kind of coming beside it like that. So I'm going to let her push a little bit more, uh, but that looks like it's going to be a big calf. So yeah. All right. That cow is not progressing. She's basically gone as far as she can. I've got another pair in the maternity. And so I'm gonna try and do what I need to do in there. But if that doesn't work, I'll move her over, but we'll see what we can do here. Oh, I gotta get a glove yet. Okay, I haven't done this before where I've tried to pull a calf not in the maternity pen, so we'll see what, whether she is okay with this. Hey, Jolene.
I'm gonna help you, sweetie. And right here you can see the hair is getting dry down here and that makes it a lot harder the fluid makes it a lot easier to help them calf but that is a big calf two big ones one small one today what's going on hey well Jolene we did it Not sure if you can see it on the camera, but head's pretty swollen from the pressure. So we give our calves Medicam when I see that. Just helps with any pain relief. But his head's up. He's breathing, but we'll see how uh, how he does here. What is it? It's a bull calf. Okay, we're processing that first calf that we had this morning, that upside down. It can hardly be called a calf. Um, that's a big one. 124 upside down. The fact that it's walking, it's been eating and sucking cow calf. They're all doing great. It's good. I don't like them that big. Um, that bull was the gateway at the shorthorn bull. And uh, its average weight last year was 90, I think four pounds is what its average weight was. So wow. this is obviously a lot heavier than that. But yeah, we don't like them that big or like that. The one outside that cab earlier, that's, uh, that's a lot nicer. I'd like them in that 90 pounds, but that one out there I'm guessing is between 70 and 80. So we'll process this calf and the one outside and they're doing good enough i think they can go right outside so wasn't uh wasn't how i like calving going i like it when the calves come easy uh on their own but uh with the upside down and that big other big one i'm glad they're all alive and hopefully they can uh, keep on going so hope you enjoyed the video thanks for taking the time to watch and have yourself a good one